Good morning. It's just before eight. I am leaving the camp. Um, don't ask me why I'm in my rain gear. It's just cold this morning, and now it's not as cold. But like, I don't know. I just left my rain gear on. Okay. Um, cause that's what I did. Um, I don't know. I figured if there's like brush, I don't want like the brush touching my legs because like everything was wet yesterday and honestly I can't deal with that again and I woke up this morning and my tent was once again covered in moisture it has a very bad condensation problem um but I don't know it's like dripping wet and I don't know what to do about it so hopefully I can get a spot to find a place to air it out today and oh my god this one looks bad so not to scare anybody but um some guy came up right behind me and i was just like staring at it like i don't want to do this and he's just like oh well gotta go in and he walked across pretty easily i mean he did like i think it was stronger than he anticipated so like or he had a misstep or something, which like sketched me out. So I, I'm like, nope, not crossing here. So I went upstream a little bit to where it was like more, I don't know, consistent. And there weren't those rapids there. Um, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me right now? <laughs> it's a pile of logs right there. <sighs> How'd I know? I just wasn't willing to do a little bit of bushwhacking. Oh. That's fine. Um, and um, anyways, so I didn't need to do that apparently. No, I walked upstream to where it was just like flowing consistently and there weren't any rapids and it was pretty even throughout. Um, it was just over my knees and yeah, I crossed it. I left my shoes on. I unbuckled my pack. I did pretty much everything right, except for I didn't take out my Garmin. Um, if it was any faster, I definitely would have. But, you know, my Garmin's buried in my pack, and I didn't want to deal with that. Um, but yeah, so hopefully that's the last forge today. stretched out I've eaten I've hung my bear bag and yeah so I'm pretty much ready to go to sleep which is good because I am exhausted today was I don't want to say it was rough because it wasn't but like it definitely was feeling hungry like I hike hiker hunger is definitely stripped today um so that's fun um also I think I'm going to try to get out of here in seven days, like through the whole thing in seven days instead of eight days. So four more days because I've already been in here for three instead of five. Um, hopefully that made sense. Um, but four more days in the bob instead of what it would have been five because if I were to do five, I would have to average 18 in this way. I would have to average 22 and a half but like 
I've been averaging that, so, you know, and if hiker hunger strikes, that means I'll be good on food. But yeah, so, I'm exhausted, and I'm gonna crawl in my tent and go to sleep, so, continuing on tomorrow.